Hey guys, what's up? Testing one, two. First test for the new YouTube channel. Rome Vision. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, stop it. shoe review for you guys i would like to welcome you to my channel it's the first shoe review so uh yeah let's get it started what we have for you first is the colin kaepernick air force one obviously everybody knows about everything that's going on with the black lives matter movement this is the box that it comes in it's a light gray box very plain i wish nike actually did something a little bit more um I don't know, maybe special with the box. I feel it's a bit plain. Um, anyways, it, it reads Air Force One CK, which stand, obviously stands for Colin Kaepernick, uh, QS, which stands for Quick Strike. This is a seven and a half. It's not my size. It's actually my girlfriend's size. These are her pair of shoes she ordered off of StockX. Well, let's get into the shoe here. So we open the box and the first thing we're greeted with is a white Air Force One packaging. You know, you got your regular uh, shoe paper here. Nothing special. The first thing that we'll see, the amazing uh, quality that these actually came with. It's such a beautiful leather and it really feels like a premium Italian leather shoe. Something that might have been handcrafted or hand stitched. They paid attention to detail on the shoe as far as quality wise has a clear uh, uh, outsole as you can see you have on the back of the shoe the man himself uh, Colin Kaepernick you can see his giant afro really cool detail on the back it's something that's gonna really make these shoes stand out on the front of the shoe we have a big K symbol as you can see the K is obviously for Kaepernick we have this black uh, seven tag which is obviously Colin Kaepernick's number on the side of the shoe we have a black Nike swoosh as well as on the inside it goes from black to kind of a gray and fades into white it kind of feels like a new buck kind of a feeling it's not leather like the rest of the shoe it has a kind of like a new buck feel to it not a super premium feel like the rest of the shoe I wish they might have maybe done the, the swoosh and leather as well. So that's a detail that I thought was a little bit interesting. The shoes come with two pairs of laces, one black and we have the white pair as well. Both look pretty cool. This pair came from StockX as you guys can see. Shipping was a bit iffy because of COVID obviously. You have the Nike Air branding on the side of the shoe. The midsole is white and the rest of the shoe is a beautiful stitched black leather as you guys can see we have a couple of uh further details about the shoe that are a bit hidden if you look at the bottom of the right shoe what you'll notice is some numbers this is the date that colin kaepernick took the infamous knee in 2016 uh colin kaepernick during i think the third preseason game he took a knee to protest racial inequality and police brutality in america and the following week or sorry he sat he actually sat during the national anthem the following week he um, he basically took a knee and throughout the regular season took a knee uh, to protest donald trump had something to say about that obviously he was not happy he tweeted out that the owner should fire anybody that basically disrespected the national anthem so colin kaepernick basically you know after the season was was finished he couldn't find a job uh nobody is hiring him and you know they said it was basically bad for business because he was so controversial what do you guys think do you guys think that he was right for taking a knee during the national anthem do you guys think that he should be able to return and have a job uh in the nfl again uh, based off of his beliefs and the things that he stands for. We also have some West Ghanaian symbology on the inner side of the... Dude. West African. West African? Ghana in West Africa, I think. Uh, okay, so wait, okay. <laughs> we have some West African Ghanaian symbology on the inner part of the tongue of each shoe. This is the left shoe. Now, according to my research, the language is Adinkra, 
and the left shoe is a fahodier symbol. Now these symbols are used in pottery and clothing. It's actually meant to symbolize freedom and emancipation. On the right shoe, on the inner side of the shoe, it's called, uh, I, I'm not sure if my pronunciation is right on this, I might butcher this, the Nokde, and it's meant to symbolize truth. It's funny because that kind of ties into the shoe itself. Truth for seven. True, true to seven. Or try, true. <laughs> it's funny because the symbol actually ties into the shoe itself. So you got the Nike Air Force One, true for seven. True to seven. God damn it, okay. <laughs> Blah! It's like I'm thinking too much about it. Okay, yeah. right? You got both shoes right there. Kind of cool. Now, if you look, that's what both shoes look like with each different lacing. I did a little bit of different lacing on this, but you got the black and white laces. Comes standard with the black laces, and they give you an extra package of the white laces. Right? All right, so these are the insoles of the Air Force One Kaepernick. If you notice, there's some interesting uh, images here. You have a bunch of roses with thorns and you have some broken masks. Now, you can leave it up to your own interpretation of what these actually mean. What I think that the masks mean is, I think the mask, the broken mask, symbolizes a broken system. What he's doing is he's shattering the norm, he's shattering the, the, the misconception that everything is okay. You have the thorns and you have the roses, that could mean that you have to go through something awful to reach something beautiful. You have to go through hard times in order to reach better times. Right now, for Colin Kaepernick, his case is being widely reviewed now, especially with the George Floyd situation going on. Those are the inside insole of the shoe. So there's uh, my review of the Colin Kaepernick Air Force Ones. Uh, let's get a little bit further information. Hey Google. When did the Colin Kaepernick Air Force Ones come out? On the website theundefeated.com, they say, The newest iteration, the Nike Air Force One X Colin Kaepernick to be released deck. 23. Deck means December. Hey Google, how much do the Colin Kaepernick Air Force Ones retail for? On the website cnn.com, they say, The sneakers will retail for $110 for adult sizing. Do you want a little more context? No thank you. There you go, folks. The Air Force One X Colin Kaepernick is made primarily of luxe black leather with the brand's reflective swoosh logo leading to a silhouette of Kaepernick's head on the heel tab. Kaepernick's logo is featured on the tongue. The sneakers will retail for $110 for adult sizing. Who's doing the review here? Anyways, <laughs> I have a second shoe for you guys coming up shortly. Uh, this is a double review special. I hope you guys enjoy. What up, what up, what up, y'all? Testing one, two, one, two. Test for YouTube. Back, we're more? Yeah. 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 No, just move it here. Oh. Because your head right now cut by half. Yeah. Okay. Is this, is this yeah, good? Yeah, like this. Yeah. 